Now, Russell, there was so much fanfare around the launch of the Sussex's not-for-profit profit Archwell, but it doesn't seem to have been the focus of their efforts recently, has it? No, good evening. Well, it's interesting, isn't it? I mean, every time that uh, Harry and Meghan pop up, whether it's sort of legal cases or talk about their charity, everybody is talking about it. But this recent revelation that they've only done one hour a week each for uh, work for their charity, Archwell, has sort of raised eyebrows. But I think it sort of, once you scratch the surface of this story, it's very, very interesting because Harry and Meghan are obviously a huge force throughout the world. Uh, they've managed to pull in an incredible over $10 million for this charity, despite only working on it uh, part time, it would seem. And, and I think once they do get the, the, the sort of legal cases that they're fighting uh, across the board uh, or out of the way, they're going to be quite a, a tour of force because. They've been talking about community engagement, talking about the, the differences they want to make. Uh, obviously, that is uh, levelled with, with uh, the, all their other activities going on, you know, fighting media cases and whatnot. But once that is out of the way, it should, it should make be clear that uh, these two really do have something to offer. And I think they can uh, really ca capitalise on their celebrity and try and make a difference in the communities they're helping out. Yeah, and that will be interesting to see if that does happen post these legal cases because, you know, so far it doesn't seem to have attracted that much in interest from donors or they haven't really um, given much in the way of grants. Uh, look, it'll be interesting to see whether it, it does become a serious charity or whether it's just part of their, their positioning and their narrative. Yeah, I think that, that that's an argument, isn't it? But uh, I mean, it's only been it's in it, it's in its infancy, really. This this charity, and the issue is for Harry and Meghan that there's been an awful lot of noise surrounding them. We've had the Netflix series on the back of the Oprah Winfrey interview. We've had Harry's uh, obviously his his memoir Spare has gone down quite badly at the palace, and uh, and all the noise surrounding that as well. So whether they were able to sort of get away from this once we've had the coronation. We still obviously don't know whether they're going to attend that, but that should be an opportunity for them to, to, to just really sort of put this uh, put this work to good use. But um, you're, you're right, I don't think we've seen too much of what they're about at the moment, and um, and hopefully that will happen in the future. Yeah, and look, to be fair, I actually really hope it does. You know, they do have so much name recognition. They do uh, have so much of that celebrity status. You really would like to see it go to, uh, like, a proper practical purpose. 